You're watching Viva Brother at Reading Festival on virtualfestivals.com. Leeds was incredible. Fantastic, yeah. especially considering that we got a straight clash with Muse, which is probably the worst clash you could have. We had a great crowd, so we were chuffed. I've yeah. never heard of them. No. Apparently they're, it's their year. What, Muse? They're, yeah, they're, they're up and coming up. band, yeah. Yeah. But um, <clears throat> a little bit better than Muse or our show at Leeds was we just um, did a signing at the signing tent, and it was really good. And, you know, we get gifts. Don't yeah, we? sometimes. We get gifts now and again. But this time we got the best gift. I was speechless. Someone gave me their dad's gold medal from the Olympics. they from like no, four, honestly. It was like 45 years old or something, and he gave it to us. And from I, the, I didn't even want to take it. It was amazing, and I've got it here with me. We can show you in a bit if you want. <laughs> if you see, it, you see how it says winner. Yeah. <laughs> Because he was a winner. A he, he was won. a winner, and now we're a winner. Is that Sydney 04? No, 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 this was like 60, 68 or I think, something. hold on, let me just check. It was Athens, was oh, it? Oh, no, it was made in China. It must be the it was Chinese, Chinese one. It was the Beijing Olympics, so it was last no, year. Yeah, that was Beijing, yeah. I think it was for Josh. Is he? Well, yeah, I mean, you're a big Libertines oh, fan, I really right? I like Libertines, and I like Baby Shambles as well. It's, you know, it's nice to play before him. Yeah. Nice lad. I'm cool. glad he's got his act together and he's playing some songs with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we caught a bit of him in Leeds. He was really good, seemed with it and everything. So yeah, it was cool. We had some ballerinas dancing on stage with him. Uh, well, Stephen Street is going to come out, who did our album. Yeah. Um, Fantastic play a song producer extraordinaire, Stephen Street. He's going to come out and play a song with us. And um, he's just going to come out and have a little jam on Steve-O, isn't he? Well, he's going he's gonna to be suspended on a crucifix and he's just going to be lowered down throughout the first sort of four songs. So it's going to be like a subtle affair. And then by the fifth song, he'll, we'll be ready. If that, hap if that does actually happen, that would be the coolest thing I've ever seen. Anyway, though, he's just going to walk on. <laughs> he'll still look fairly cool, though. He's got quite a... Well, yeah, he's recorded The Qu Queen is Dead, he's so got a good story did all right. That bloke as well. And the famous first words. Criti brother. Critically acclaimed. Yeah. Japan was mega. This Album whole, coming out. This whole festival room. season's been amazing, I think. Like, yeah, like, like I think when you're a punter, you, you think there's a ready-made crowd for you, you know, for bands. They just walk out and there's a ready-made crowd. But when you get there, you're like, oh, fuck, um, is anyone going to watch us? And every time we've been overwhelmed that people actually want to come and see our band. So it's been amazing. And uh, yeah, the album coming out and... And, and it's going really well in Japan, like Sam said. Like, yeah, people actually likes over there. Got good reviews over there. Who would have thought? Well, the last one we did was in Japan, and that and um, Liam Gallagher came over and said hello to the boys. Yeah, it was my birthday, so it was quite fun. Happy birthday! And he took back everything he said and said that he actually really likes us. <laughs> it's true, actually, yeah. In a nutshell. And he was he was quite chipper considering his shop just got looted like that. I think it was that day. So yeah. So you and Liam are like that now. Yeah, we're like best, best friends. Mates. Yeah. I'm gonna ring him after this actually, <laughs> see if he wants to go for Chinese or something. <laughs> <laughs> he called me little though, but he's quite short as well. Okay. They call him the roller though, don't they? They do call him the roller. And he wants to be a millionaire as well. Strokes. Pole. Pole. Damn. Actually, no, take back strokes. Yeah. They're better live. Uh, yeah, okay, fine. I'm going to go with the boys. I'm going to stay with them. What was I listening to? Well, we tribes. We were listening yeah. to Tribes last. Yeah. And. Um, Who else have we spent a lot recently? Cage Elephant. Jessica Lee Mayfield. Yeah. There's, there's Singer songwriter Christina from. Christina Milian. No, no, Sam. No, no. 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 Jessica Lee Mayfield. Fine. <laughs> Christina yeah. Milian. Not fine. Okay. Gorilla? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, in Montreal. There was some weirdo in a gorilla suit that danced for the entire set, and it was about 100 degrees outside. So, fair play to the gorilla. Yeah. <laughs> Sam's one. Were you at the show today? <laughs> he, he, uses that. The show. he uses that. We've been off tour for like a week. You go to a girl. Been at the show then? <laughs> what show? 100% success rate. The gun show. 
No, he doesn't have any. He, actually, I've got a gun. <laughs> I've got a right. gun. The last uh, time I can specifically remember is when we did our Beat the Rocks and you were standing on the edge of our balcony and there's some girls like naked. on the balcony like a cartoon. Yeah, he was sport. naked. There was like people on the other side saying, who the fuck do you think you are, the Beatles? And we're like, no, yeah. no. <laughs> just, just a naked boy. Just naked. Can <laughs> we just get drunk? I'm just on holiday trying to get a bit of tan on my buns. <laughs>